we've taken the year 10 cohort down to Wallaroo, where this week they're gonna be pushed to their limits, both mentally and physically, to gain points for their house to see who triumphs over the week of Survivor, who will take home the perpetual trophy. We have four houses, Brimblecombe who are red, Bulldog who are green, Warren who are blue, and White who are yellow. I think my house, um, at the beginning we didn't really have much communication but as this camp has gone on we've like developed comfort so communication is one, perseverance, like even when we felt like giving up we just like kept going and we just didn't let anything stop us. We really just worked together well as a team being like the biggest house. We started off not very passionate or anything but today we um, showed a lot more teamwork and listened and encouraged each other a lot more. Um, my highlight is definitely being kayaking. I enjoy doing it a lot. My highlight has been really hanging out with like friends and uh, really just being able to spend time with each other. The purpose of this camp is to build house spirits and house community and also get us closer to the people in our year levels. I learnt people see me more as a leader than anything else. For myself, I think that it had a really positive impact on me and that it taught me teamwork and perseverance and that when you feel like giving up, you just got to keep going. And yes, it was, it was a really good camp. I feel like I've learnt that I'm a definite leader, but that I'm also happy to allocate jobs if I know that somebody else can do it better. I've learned that I'm kind of a bit of a quiet contributor. I don't really go up front much, but I'm still more I'm still there, I'm still contributing. <laughs>